A lot of factors determine how far a punt is going to travel. <clears throat> Talent being the most important. Thanks for pointing that out, Dan. Air drag is also a big factor. That's why punters try to kick the ball in a spiral to reduce its air drag. Just how important is air drag? The drag force on a football is proportional to the density of the air through which the ball travels and the square of the ball's air speed. Air density depends either on the weather or the altitude. For example, a punt that's kicked with an initial speed of 30 meters per second and a launch angle of 45 degrees will travel about four yards further in Boulder, Colorado than it does in Lincoln, Nebraska because of Boulder's higher altitude. Similarly, if the barometric pressure drops from 32 inches down to 29 inches like it does before a big storm, our punt will go about four yards further. Wind is also a problem because it affects the relative airspeed in our equation. A headwind of 30 miles per hour will shorten our punt by more than 20 yards. Knowing about all these factors can help a punter plan his kicking strategy. Of course, all the football physics in the world won't help the guy if he runs afoul of the black shirts.